Today I'm gonna to show you how to print your first 3D print on your Bamboo Lab A1 Mini. Chances are you just got done setting up this machine and you're needing some help with that first step on printing your first print. And don't worry, I totally got you covered on this. Let's first start by making sure you got a couple things done with your printer before we jump into the first print. Make sure your printer is plugged in first of all. Then our last step is to turn on the printer. There's a little on switch back here. All right guys, congratulations. Our printer is now ready to go. Let's click the start button and it's gonna walk us through this small little startup where we can connect to the Wi-Fi and start printing. It will ask you a bunch of basic questions like what country you're in, what language you're using, and it will eventually ask you to connect to your Wi-Fi. You don't absolutely have to use Wi-Fi, but it makes printing from your computer, laptop, and your phone so much easier. It will also do a handful of calibrations that the printer needs to do. And after those are done it's going to alert you that it needs to be updated to the newest form of firmware all right guys now that your machine is set up we are now ready to load filament i'm going to walk you through step by step how to do this step number one is to get your filament ready find the end of it make sure it's a clean cut and it's not tangled Make sure the filament is aligned properly to be placed on the spool holder to where it feeds up into the PFTE tube. The next step is to start feeding the filament up into that tube until you start to feel it come to a stop. The tubes are a translucent color so you can kind of see the filament go through it. Keep pushing until you feel the filament come to a stop. Next, go to the printer screen and click on the filament button. Then click on load. A screen will then pop up will allow you to choose what type of filament that you're going to be choosing. Click yes and then it will allow you to choose the type of filament. Choose by brand and the type of filament. Then click OK. Then the A1 Mini will go through all these steps. When the printer is done with all these steps, a new prompt will pop up. Next, the printer will ask if you can see the new filament being extruded. If you can, click done. If you don't, click retry. Take a look at the extruder. If you can see your new color filament coming through, you know that you are good and you can click on done. All right, guys, let's go on over back to the LED screen. We're going to print our first file. So click on print files here. And there's actually a bunch of built in files that we can print that come with it. So pick which one you want to print and then actually click on the file. I'm going to print this 3D Benchy and then click next and it's going to print your file. So the printer is going to go through a bunch of calibration process before it actually prints, but it will eventually get to it. If you take a closer look at your nozzle, you'll see that it is purging filament that is perfectly normal in between each individual 3D printing. It's also very important to know that we printed this 3D file from the storage on your 3D printer that came with it, but chances are you're going to want to be printing things from your cell phone or your computer. Usually the first step is printing from your cell phone. If you need help setting that up with your printer, consider checking out this next video right here.